Employment rose 2.4 percent in Clark County and 2.1 percent in Washoe County from September of 2016 to September of 2017, above the national rate of 1 percent. Average weekly wages fell 5.3 percent in Clark County and rose 0.1 of a percentage point in Washoe County over the year, compared to 0.6 percent decrease nationally. Employment in Clark County is at 970,200 and Washoe County at 218,800, which accounted for 88.9 percent of the total employment in Nevada. Eureka County's average weekly wage of 1,762 was the highest in the state and Lincoln County the lowest at 753. NASA and the Department of Energy's National Security Site Administration have successfully demonstrated a new nuclear reactor power system that could enable long-duration crewed missions to the moon, Mars, and destinations beyond. NASA announced the results of the demonstration called the Kilopower Reactor Using Sterling Technology, or CRUSTY, experiment during a news conference on Wednesday, Wednesday at its Glenn Research Center in Cleveland, Ohio. The Kilopower experiment was conducted at Nevada National Security Security site from November of 2017 through March of this year. Officials say safe, efficient, and plentiful energy will be the key to future robotic and human exploration. They expect the Kilopower project to be an essential part of lunar and Mars power architectures as they evolve. Kilopower is a small, lightweight fusion power system capable of providing up to 10 kilowatts of electrical power, enough to run several average households continuously for at least 10 years. Four Kilopower units would provide enough power to establish an outpost. NASA says the pioneering power system is ideal for the moon, where power generation from sunlight is difficult because lunar nights are equivalent to 14 days on Earth. They add that kilopower gives us the ability to do much higher power missions and to explore the shadow craters of the moon. Scientists hope to start sending astronauts for long stays on the moon and to other planets, and that will require a new class of power that they've needed before. The prototype power system uses a solid cast uranium-235 reactor core about the size of a paper towel roll. Law enforcement agencies have joined forces and are focusing on distractor drivers from now until May 14th. The Nevada Highway Patrol is working diligently to urge motorists to keep their eyes on the road and put away cell phones or other items that cause distractions. Five seconds is the average time your eyes are off the road while texting. When traveling at 55 miles per hour, that's enough time to cover the length of a football field blindfolded. I'm Deanne O'Donnell. That's your news across Nevada.